Praise be Jesus Christ. I finally found a story that I was looking for some record of for years. And I found it in Nicholas Diaz's book, A Time to Die. The author visited eight different European monasteries and spoke with the monks about the mystery of death and passing to eternal life and what it's like to die in a monastery. Fascinating read, but he tells the story when he was visiting the Grand Chartreuse in France, visiting the Carthusians, which are the strictest religious order, um, ancient religious order in the Catholic Church, the Carthusians. You need to learn about the Carthusians. But anyways, the Carthusians, by the way, their whole life is pretty much kept in silence, strict fasting, they keep vigil, middle of the night, every night. They're, they're radical, they're an awesome community. You need to learn about them. But anyways, here's the story. In the 19th century, the monks made an astonishing discovery. While digging a grave next to the oldest ones, they came upon a perfectly preserved corpse. Its preservation after decades in the ground was a miracle. The monks ran to the Reverend Father. His response was final. Close the grave, dig next to it, and don't tell anyone about it. And so this is typical Carthusian um, hiddenness. The Carthusians are so hidden, they don't even write the names of the, the person on the grave cross where the person dies. They, they hardly have a single canonized saint because they don't, uh, it says here, the Carthusian Monasteries makes saints. It doesn't publish them. That's how secret they are. And um, anyways, I, I just heard about this story years ago. I thought, well, wow, that's a really cool story. And here it is in writing in this uh, powerful book, A Time to Die. And I have a scripture for you. Our Lord Jesus said to Martha, I am the resurrection and the life. Whoever believes in me, even if he dies, will live. And everyone who lives and believes in me will never die. Do you believe this? Viva Cristo.